LEGO Creator 3 in 1 remains strong, and in summer 2022, it's gonna be awesome. The Viking ship was revealed a few days ago, but we have the noodle shop right now, and also a look, closer look at the underwater uh, creatures, I think, under the sea treasure hunt, that's the set name. The Viking ship, I think everyone is oozing over for a good reason. It's brilliant, and we have been fooled! Because the, the sail is brig build from the initial pictures a few days, few I think a week ago. It wasn't necessarily clear that it's a brig build or a cloth sail. It is brig build. So, I mean, that's cool, right? It's it's going to be a, that many more bricks and just like that more, more, much more sturdiness. Very cool design. I believe we do get the first time ever female Viking headwear of sorts. And it's gonna go really well, this set particular. Uh, it's gonna go pretty well with the goat boat from Thor Love and Thunder. Three in one set, which means we get an extra build for some sort of a blacksmith, I believe, for the Viking village. And a little bit of a, of a creature. There's a name for it. I gotta find out what's the name. Be, uh, in the main build, we also get the serpent. So there's a little bit of a teal blue color included with the set. Fenris Wolf, that's the name from the Midgardian lore. Uh, so basically a creature they fight quite often in the lore. It's actually, I think, was also mentioned in games like God of War or things like that. It's kind of like similar in multiple lores. Anyway, cool build. I think that's going to be a very creative three in one overall. The blacksmith itself, it can go well together with the ideas blacksmith said, even though they're kind of different lores, different eras even to to say that. Uh, <laughs> the cow build is actually pretty funny here. Very simple, like... Okay, I mean, yeah, I'll take it. It's just, you know, the way designers come up with those three-in-one designs, they're very creative. So whatever bricks you have left, you build a cow like that. Pretty cool. The minifigs are really brilliant here. We have tons of Vikings, both female and male. Two male Vikings, I mean two female Vikings. It's gonna be a minifig galore for this set. So I think it's gonna be even better uh, pickup than, say, the, the castle. Uh, the creator castle and uh, the previous pirate ship. I've actually all the trifecta of sets uh, punching into those uh, old times of Lego are just worth a pickup. But I think this one's gonna be $120, $120, so a little bit less value than the previous two. Is that a phoenix? No, that's a dragon or a wyvern, I think, right? Yeah, that's gotta be a, some sort of a wyvern they're, they're fighting. Yes, just confirming the price tag, it's $120 at 1192 pieces, so. Uh, yeah, it's, it's gonna be just a little bit more pieces than your usual set, so I guess we can we can swallow that price. The Noodle Shop is the brand new reveal, 569 pieces at 45, so I, think, I guess the price in dollars will be similar to this. It's another 3-in-1 mini modular, as I like to call them. Uh, very good corner building overall, just first impression, we get a ice cream cart, or more like a tricycle. Uh, there's a little dog build, I think that's that must be like a dust hunt or something. Um, and overall, uh, your typical, I don't know, San Francisco downtown style uh, corner noodle shop. Really, really like this one. And once I start my LEGO City, I think the Creator 3 in 1 modulars, mini modulars, will become a staple of my design. The alternate builds have a bike shop, I believe, with a little rickshaw. Uh, I think that's what it is. Also, very cool, gotta notice the the flesh tone color for the wall, something that we got a little bit in the boutique hotel, but this is more prevalent in this set. I really like this one. And the third one is, I think, a game store? What is that? That's the gotta be a pad. Some sort of an arcade. Maybe it's an arcade. Yeah, it is an arcade. You have like a game with a bike attached to it and some sort of like a treasure hunt machine. Uh, so just gotta get three of these and you're gonna have like a nice little nerdy district in downtown uh, of your city. Really good one. I think that's one of my favorite ones of the recent years. It's gonna be very popular. You can also switch. You can see how you can a little bit switch things or this this uh, connect part of the build to have just a noodle shop and the apartment can be separate. I think that's what it shows. The 31130 uh, treasure under the sea treasure hunt. There is no price tag yet. It's at 522 pieces. I believe it's gonna be like a 40, maybe $50 price tag. Now, first impression is that it reminds me of Aquazone. You guys remember Aquazone, those yellow subs and kind of like a space but underwater theme back in the day, back in my day. That was a thing, a very cool build for the octopus. And the alternate builds are, I believe, a lobster and some sort of a... What is that? The sub is definitely my favorite build of the all. Uh, I think the first version is overall the best build of the three. Let's see if I can switch to this. This is like, what is this? It's a... Oh, it's a manta. It's a manta. I was looking at it from the side. This is the mouth, the front. Those are the, the manta wings, if you will. That's a manta. And there is a small reef to go with that. 
And the lobster is very, very cute. Is that the lobster or is that the, the other creature I can't name, remember the name of right now in English? But hey, here we are. And a smaller sub as well. I still like the first one the most. Oh, uh, well, that's not good. Uh, a skeleton with a camera uh, uh, underwater. Guy got stuck. Ooh, dark, very dark. Are you guys waiting for these? I know I'm waiting for the Viking ship. This is the, 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 the first pickup for sure. That noodle shop is very cute. The creatures, third in my choice list, uh, but the, the Viking ship is just so good. And we can just, you know, I could have talked about it a few days ago, but now we have high resolution pictures of this. The noodle shop, mm, mm, I, 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 I can already see a little downtown district in my small Lego city that I start building in a single or two tables that this thing's gonna fit just fine. All right, thank you so much for watching. As always, hit the like, subscribe, comment section is open below. You know how it works and I love you and I know you are great. <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next vi video. More summer news coming. Uh, stay tuned. Talk to you soon. Bye.